Mr. Chairman, Mr. Barton, I have an amendment number 34 at the desk. Mr. Chairman. Gentlelady from Colorado reserves Order. a point of order. Gentleman is offering an amendment which is at the desk. The clerk will report the amendment and we would ask that it be distributed. Amendment, excuse me, amendment offered by Mr. Barton. In section 300. Without objection, the amendment will be considered as read. The gentleman from Texas is recognized for two minutes in support of his amendment. Mr. Chairman, I'll try to give you back some of that time. The base text that's before us has a new program that allows the federal government and the taxpayers that fund the federal government to pay the COBRA premiums for people who have lost their jobs. That is, that is a, a noble idea. However, it puts no means test on it. For example, an executive with Lehman Brothers who's making millions of dollars a year and has millions of dollars in personal assets lost their job. Under the base text, they are eligible for COBRA premium assistance under this bill. I don't think that's right. So I am offering the Lehman Brothers Amendment to the bill that simply says if you have an annual income of over $100,000 and assets of over a million dollars, you don't receive the COBRA premium assistance subsidy in the base text of the bill. It's that simple. Gentlemen, yield back the balance of his time. I don't see anybody that wants to talk on my time, so I do. And, and Mr. No. Pallone, are you prepared to speak on this amendment? Well, Mr. Chairman, I mean, Gentleman is recognized for two minutes. You know, my concern with all this is that, you know, right now, because way. of the situation that we face, you know, where people lose their job at any given time in the year um, and, um, you know, may find their circumstances change dramatically, um, that, um, you know, you, you might be making, I don't know what did the gentleman say, $100,000 last year, but then all of a sudden you're in, you know, January of this year and you have, and you're, and you've uh, lost your job and you have no money. So I just think that when we start getting into these, you know, me, these uh, caps or means or assets tests, um, it really isn't appropriate given the fact that some people find themselves in a situation where they have lost their job and, um, you know, they may not be any different than anybody else uh, at, at that point in time. So, you know, this is temporary. Um, I understand what the gentleman is trying to achieve, but I, I, I am concerned that once you start going down this road, we are going to start eliminating people who may actually uh, need the help. And um, I haven't, you know, I'm, I'm looking at the actual amendment here, and I would be concerned um, that we might find people in that category. Gentleman, you? Yeah. I, I, I think there's some strong arguments to make for a means test, but we're, it, I can't see how we would set up such a means test. We'd have to take somebody who just lost their job. That, that's what makes them eligible for COBRA. And then try to figure out what their income is. If, if you go backwards, their income might have been pretty good. But if you go to that moment, their income may not be all that good since they lost their jobs. And then you'd have to set up an assets test. And I don't know how you do that for a program that's only going to run for two years. So I, uh, I would join you in opposing the amendment. Uh, would the gentleman Mr. yield? Mr. Chairman, I'll withdraw speaker. my reservation. The gentleman lady withdraws her amendment. Uh, Last four seconds. Mr. Barton. Let me simply say that some of these temporary programs sometimes become permanent programs. It took us 100 years to repeal the temporary surtax on telephone service for the Spanish-American <laughs> War. So I would, I would be leery of calling some of these programs temporary. Well, I don't think anybody intends this to be a permanent, uh, permanent program. All time has expired on the amendment. We're going to proceed at the request of Mr. Barton to a roll call vote, and we'd like the clerk to call the roll. Mr. Waxman? No. Mr. Waxman? No. Mr. Dingle? No. Mr. Dingle? No. Mr. Markey? Mr. Boucher? Mr. Pallone? No. Mr. Pallone? No. 
Mr. Gordon. Mr. Rush. Ms. Eshoo. No. Ms. Eshoo, no. Mr. Stupak. Mr. Stupak, no. Mr. Engel. <coughs> Mr. Green. No. Mr. Green, no. Ms. Deget. No. Ms. Deget, no. Mrs. Caps. Mrs. Caps, no. Mr. Doyle. Ms. Harmon. No. Ms. Harmon, no. Ms. Schakowsky. Ms. Schakowsky, no. Mr. Gonzalez. No. Mr. Gonzalez, no. Mr. Inslee. Ms. Baldwin. No. Ms. Baldwin, no. Mr. Ross. No. Mr. Ross, no. Mr. Weiner. No. Mr. Weiner, no. Mr. Matheson. Mr. Butterfield. Mr. Butterfield, no. Mr. Melanson. Mr. Barrow. Mr. Barrow, no. Mr. Hill. Mr. Hill, no. Ms. Matsui. Ms. Matsui, no. Mrs. Christensen. Mrs. Christensen, no. Ms. Castor. Ms. Castor, no. Mr. Sarbanes. Mr. Sarbanes, no. Mr. Murphy of Connecticut. Mr. Con Murphy of Connecticut, no. Mr. Space. Mr. Space, no. Mr. McNerney. Mr. McNerney, no. Ms. Sutton. Ms. Sutton, no. Mr. Braley. Mr. Braley, no. Mr. Welch. Mr. Bar Mr. Barton. Mr. Barton, aye. Mr. Hall. Mr. Hall votes aye. Mr. Upton. Mr. Stearns. Mr. Stearns votes aye. Mr. Deal. Mr. Deal, aye. Mr. Whitfield. Mr. Shimkus. Mr. Shattuck. Mr. Shattuck, aye. Mr. Blunt. Mr. Blunt, aye. Mr. Boyer. Mr. Boyer votes aye. Mr. Radonovich. Mr. Radonovich, aye. Mr. Pitts. Mr. Pitts, aye. Ms. Bono Mack. Mr. Walden. Mr. Walden, aye. Mr. Terry. Mr. Rogers. <clears throat> Mr. Rogers, aye. Mrs. Myrick. Mr. Sullivan. Mr. Murphy of Pennsylvania. Mr. Murphy, Pennsylvania, aye. Mr. Burgess. Mr. Burgess votes aye. Ms. Blackburn. Mr. Gingry. Mr. Gingry votes aye. Mr. Sully. Mr. Scullies. Mr. Rush, Mr. I'm sorry, Mr. Rush votes no. Mr. Gordon, Mr. Gordon votes no. Mr. Engel, Mr. Engel votes no. Have all members responded to the vote? Mr. Markey, have you voted? Mr. Markey votes no. Any other member wish to respond to the vote? If not, the, uh, the clerk will tally the vote. On that vote, Mr. Chairman, there were 14 ayes and 30 noes. 14 ayes and 30 noes, the amendment is not agreed to.